the team to get three points. Looking ahead to this weekend, it's probably, well, every game from now on, the next game is the biggest game, but you couldn't want a, uh, a bigger one than Saturday against Cambridge United. They're on a bit of a roll at the moment, 3-0 win last night over Salisbury, and also with the FA Trophy win. How big a test is that going to be? Um, look, every game is a big test. I, I went to see Cambridge in the uh, FA Trophy, um, and as are a lot of the trophy finals, it wasn't a great game to watch. I don't believe that, uh, I believe Cambridge have played far better than that in the conference games. Um, the score went exactly as I thought it would be. I didn't think it was a particularly good game um, and they didn't really show their teeth. They scored four goals but I've seen them play a lot better. Uh, I think what was more interesting was the way they got three points uh, last night against Salisbury because you know you've got the old expression after the Lord Mayor's show when it can quite often go wrong um, and it and it didn't you know they come straight off and I suppose in, in that camp now that there be a, there's a little bit more relaxed now they've got the trophy out the tension was building up throughout the week results were getting becoming indifferent because players didn't want to get injured for the trophy they didn't, you know, they wanted to make sure they were going to be in the side. It was on their minds about the families that had gone to Wembley. And that's been shaken off now. That's been buried. That's done and dusted and they won it. And that, to me, the result last night was a reflection of that. Um, and they come back now. So it will be, it'll be a tough game for us on Saturday. But make no mistake, it's going to be a tough game for Cambridge as well. We're not going up there to sort of be the, um, making up the numbers for them to parade the FA Trophy round. Um, we're going there with a serious intent of winning the game.